don't know. Um, so I'm not sure. All right. Fine. Okay, so the lot bottom line on pay pay on the base. Okay, so Miyoima Miyoima Danan. So again, we were talking about the different Lashinas that you use in a get. So we said that he has to write from today and further. So Miyoima Danan, La Fukumed of Yoisi. The word Miyoima Danan from today. Is it Danan or Danan? Danan, I think, yeah. La Fukumed of Yoisi. It's coming to Exclude of Yoisi. Domas Manish Shtarma Chiyakhalov. Rabbi Yoisi. Holds that the, the man of the star proves when the star was chal. Meaning, when you have a guy like we learned uh, last week, two weeks ago, about the get, not uh, right. So he said that Rabbi Yossi holds that if you put this man in there, it's considered as if the get was chal when it was written. So, therefore, if he dies, it's not a get after his death. Right, so here we're saying you have to write the we're saying now the Gemara here is saying that you have to write from today. Even though you, even if you write as man in the star, you have to write specifically in the star that it's from today. Fine. Um alam. What about la alam? Meaning that's like la alam la al maya forever, right? La fuke midabamine ravamin of nachman comes to exclude the question the Rava had from Nachman. Domar Hayoim. Right, we had this a few days ago, where he he asks, "What's if a guy, if a guy could says to his wife, today I'm divorcing you, tomorrow I'm re I'm marrying you, tomorrow you're not my wife. Tomorrow I'm sorry, today you're not my wife, tomorrow you are my wife. So he only is divorcing you for one day. So the Gemara had said that it's a pro, that it's a problem. Yeah. So I mean, the Gemara said, no, it's not a problem. The, 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 get, the get is considered a get. So that's what the word la'olam is coming to exclude. Fine. Gufa shall get shikhrur, hareyat paschayra, and hareyat la'atzvachah. The main part of a get shikhrur is you're a paschayra, and you're for yourself. So it's going to be Yehuda, the shtar zvini, the abdi. Rabbi Yehuda was masakin by the, 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 uh, the shtar of the sale. That you give for a slave, meaning a guy sells a slave to another to, to, to somebody else. He has to write a he has to write a, a star. So after the non, this is what it's supposed to say in the star. Our Evid, Mutztuk La Abdoi, he's Mutztuk, meaning his his I think it comes from the word Sadiq, but meaning that's his his uh his not his goal in life, his his uh right, his uh Destiny. He's destined to be an effort. Meaning, I'm telling ah, he's an effort, but me and he's, and he's going to another. He's, he's, a good, he's a good slave. He's a good Basically, <laughs> Basically right. He's a perennial slaver. I don't know if that's a, right. Upater va'ater min charuri. And he's potter from any sort of freedom. Right? Meaning, he's he's a slave. Umin alule, and from any sort of ilulim, as as anybody has any tainas on him, umin arure, malko malkasa, and the king and the queen don't have any tainas on him, meaning he doesn't own, uh, he doesn't, he doesn't. Uh, I think it means he doesn't owe money, and he's not in legal trouble. I meaning he doesn't have any legal trouble. We don't, we don't, we don't have, we didn't take a mortgage out on him. You know? <laughs> yeah, basically, yeah. yeah, basically, there's no liens, those no no liens on him. <laughs> right, yeah. <laughs> right. And he doesn't have any meaning nobody else has has uh meaning this is what you do for uh what do you call it? Uh when you buy a house, you have to do title, right? I nobody know, else sir. has any right the title. They, they did they did the title search for you, and nobody else can claim he's their slave. mum, and he doesn't have any mum, umin shin, and and he doesn't have any shrin, meaning any uh, pimples, right? That could come out two in two years, and that are and whether and they're they're chadas whether they're new or they're old, right? Meaning there are these type of pimples that 
I, I don't know, they go away and then they resurface after two years. Right? So, what is this guy, 14? Yeah, <laughs> I wasn't sure what type of pimples these eggs are. It says are. a boil it, here, not a, it says a boil, not a pimple. I mean, a boil is just a, it's just a, I don't know if it's a fancy word for pimple or a not fancy word for pimple. I'm saying, what's the big deal? So he has boils. And then they're both infections. So whatever. You got a doctor in the house somewhere. So Rashi really says it seems to be a beauty thing. It really it seems from Rashi, it's pimple. The Mois Lamekam Kame. We had this once before, right? That uh yes. That an Evid had uh, what was that more about? Uh, he had pimples and he said, I won't stand in front of you. Something like that. Anyways, Rashi seems yeah, to be worth less money. The, the uglier, the uglier right. slaves are worth worth more or less. Right, very yeah, very good. Yeah. Um Yeah, so that's what Rashi seems to be saying. It's a beauty thing, but it could come. It could resurface, meaning you could take like what's the name of that medication they take for pimples now? It's a heavy duty stuff. Uh, I forgot. Officially takes care of yeah, the rest of the life. You need to be on birth control. You need to be on birth control. With it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Accutane. Uh, it's crazy stuff. So, Accutane, very good. Is do I keep tripping out? Is it going smooth? Or I keep, or it's chopped. A little bit. I was going to tell you to maybe go the phone route. So. Uh, it's like 80%. Yeah, it's been, okay, that's not good. 80% is no good. Hold on. Let me just call in. Sorry. Welcome to Zoom. Okay, can you hear me? Yeah, we're good? We're good, we're good. Okay, good. Sorry about that. I should have done it before. Okay, so anyway, so they, he's free from pimples. Maya Su says, so how do you heal these pimples if you don't have Accutane? Somewhere I buy you. You take uh, ginger and some sort of uh, silver from where you, where you melt metal. The Kavrisa is gophris, the sulfur. The cholot, the chamra, and you take vinegar, wine vinegar, or mishcha, the zeta, and olive oil. But not the kriyvara. That's the only way to do it. And and not some sort of not the white not the shaykule, but gatzah the avza, and you smear it with a with feathers from a goose. Okay, that's how you heal these pimples. Right? Okay, whatever that means. So it's an interesting thing because let's say somebody, let's say, uh, so this is talking about for a slave, and what happens if a girl or a guy has pimples and uses cover up, right? Uses you know uses cover up. I get this question. The guy's on a date. He wants to use cover up for a pimple, or a chassan has the pimples and he wants to use cover up, right? Make a choice. to sell himself as a slave first if he wants it to well, work. I mean, it only works for slaves. No, but if you have to write this in a slave thing, culture can in a spouse. No, marriage. We're all slaves. <laughs> oh. well, can you mute that guy? No, yeah, we're all using movies. cover up to some extent. Oh, was it Rock was it was I'm just trying to do a little more entertainment than the other uh, you know, disturbances we get. <laughs> okay. Anyway, fine. Right. That's a, that's that. Now, Shloisha Gitten Psulin. There are three Gitten that are puzzled. Um. The imnisus of lot kosha, so it, is, it gets a little technical, not hard, but a little technical here. There's different levels of puzzle gitten. So here we're saying there's three gitten that are puzzle. The imnisus of lot kosha, but if she gets married and obviously has a, a kid, then the kid is okay. The kid is not a mamza. Why? Because it's a rabbanon, meaning midairaisa, the get is a good get. Midairabanon, it's not a good get. So, but if it's a Drabonon, the Drabonon are not going to make Mamzerim, even though we saw that according to Rav Meir, it will make Mamzerim, which we'll see the Gemara is going to refer to that in a minute. So, what are the three cases? Let's say the get, he wrote the get in his, by his own. It's, it's got his, his the Balabas's handwriting, but there's no Adam whatsoever. 
So Minatoira, that get is a good get. So Rabbanan say it needs Aidim. That's case number one. Yesha love Aidim, vain by man. It has Aidim, but it doesn't have when it was written. In the Rabbanan, that's an issue, right? Because you gotta have a date in the star, other in the get, otherwise you could have all sorts of fights over the finances. Third case is Yesh by man. It has his man. But it only has one eight. Only one one eight. Yeah? So we'll see in the Gemara exactly what this case is. These three get an apostle, Vim Nisha Nisis, a Vlad Kosher, and if she gets married, the Vlad is Kosher. So Vilyazar Aimir. So as it says, Ava Pishaina love Adam Elish and Nasan love Fne Adam Kosher. Right, but Rabbi Lazar says even if there's no Adam on a star, as long as the a, the get was given in front of Adam, the get is kosher. So, meaning, because this is what we, we Akiva, we said we're going to discuss this is Akiva, but uh, um, yeah. So uh, this is Rebbe, the classic Rabbi Lazar that Adam is Sira Karti. That the main thing is the Adam of the get being handed over. The main thing is not to get the Adam that are signed on the get. And and he can collect, um, I mean, she could collect, or anybody, any sort of uh, uh, any sort of star like this. Well, we'll see in the Gemara whether it applies to every star or not. But and you could collect from the chassan that are meshubed with this star, meaning it's a legitimate star. Because according to the Rebbe the only reason why Adam actually sign on the get is for it's for tikkun olam, right? Because if you don't have, meaning if you don't have them signed on the get, then these Aiden die or they can't find the Aiden for the Mestira. So how is she going to prove that she was divorced? If they sign on the get, so then she then you have proof. If you don't sign on the get, then and all you have is the Aiden Mestira, so then it's very hard to prove that she actually got, got divorced. Okay, so basically the three cases in the Mishnah where the get is possible, but if she if she got remarried and had kids, the kids are not mamzerim. And then you had Rabbi Eliezer Shita who says that the main adam is the adam of the handing over the get, not that are signed on the get. Okay, the Gemara says now the Gemara goes through a bunch of cases from the last few blocks why it was not mentioned in this Mishnah that that would also have the same halacha. The Gemara says Vasuleka, are there no other cases of where they're not supposed the get is no good, but if they get married, if she gets remarried to somebody else, then the kids are not mamzerim. But you could get yoshan. Said the case of get yoshan, right? Get yoshan was where they slept together after the get. So we're afraid that maybe there was a kedushin. So but there we also said, we said hasam loyseite. There she doesn't have to get divorced, but hacha teite. Here she has to. Now we're going to see in Amar Beis whether she has to even after the kids or not. But there, if they got married to get Yashon, she got married to somebody else. She does not have to get divorced. Here, she does have to get divorced. Right. So it's a, here is stronger. That's only according to the Mandam. We're going to see on Amar Beis is that holds that in our mission she has to get she has to go out. But according to the Shita that says here she does not have to leave. Michael and Mema. And what are you going to say? It's the same exact case. Right? So, there we said, according to at least one Shita, she could get married, meaning a get Yashon is if they slept together, they're not supposed to give that get. They got to get, they have to write a new get. But if they did give the get, then she's allowed to get married to somebody else. Here we're talking about Bidiyevit. I meaning here only if she got married can so she can she stay married. So therefore it's a different case. Okay, well you could get get kereach. We said there was the get that's bald, right? Which is we said that a get you you get a you make a get makusher in order to, for kehana when they're divorced and we want to delay the get so you keep folding it. You need an aid on every fold. And we said that if you're missing some fold, that's called a get kereach and it's no good. That's the awesome havlad mamza. There, the, the Vlad is a mamza, they said, right? Hacha ha Vlad kosher. Here, the Vlad is kosher, meaning if somebody gets divorced with this puzzle get, the bald get, then the Vlad is a mamza. Hacha the Vlad is kosher. 
Gemara asked Hani Chalur Meir to Amar Kol Hamashana Mitzvah She said Well, we get in a blood Ramzer. So that's a parenthesis. So some some are good, some are not. That's what we just mentioned before. That goes according to Reb Meir, who holds that if you right or a, a massive chiddush that Reb Meir holds. Reb Meir holds that if the Rabbanon pasul a get and somebody gets married with that get, anyways, the kids are mamzerim, right? So that works according to Reb Meir. El Rabbanon, but according to Rabbanon, will say the kids are not mamzerim. Michael Amema. Why is that case of get the bold get different in this case? So my answer is Hasam Tate say. Um, there she has to get divorced. Hacha loyteite. Here you don't have to get divorced. So in the same same kasha as we had a few minutes ago. Hanichel mandam hacha loyteite. That's good according to mandam here. In our cases, in our three cases, that say she doesn't have to get divorced. El mandam hacha teite. But according to mandam here, that says she does have to get divorced. Ma'ikol ameimar. What are you going to say? The one says makusha like a mairi. We're not talking about makusha get the get dealing with kaihanim. Why? Because about the get that's folded over. That's not included because that's not a common get. That's not a common case. We're talking about common getting. I guess Kahanam, it's not common for them to get divorced. I don't know. Or it's just a smaller percentage of society. So Mamela, the commission is saying, we're not dealing with the with the weird situations. We're dealing with the standard situation. From C- okay. Siakov, excuse me. Yeah. How do you understand uh, uh, the the Mishan Till when is the Chachamim in history? A good question. Good question. I can still win in the Chachamim in history. Uh, some Chachamim still believe it applies now. Um, that's a miss. Maybe it does. I don't know. I don't think it. I don't think it. It. Uh, it applies. What do you mean, Yaakov? Yeah, we we had, we discussed this already. It's the case. Of, I know uh, we. Dis- I know stuff. we discussed. I'm just wondering what we said or if we thought of anything else. Um, I don't know. I don't know. I, okay. don't, I never saw anything about that. Did you ever, did you ever, you ever have a chew on something like that? Uh, first, I'm not a Bucky in my Ramesha chew, and even if I was, I certainly would forget him. <laughs> I feel like this I, is the type of thing that would be that would that, that would be famous, right? It, it would be a yeah, it's, but I don't know. I don't know. Um, I, I, I don't know when at what point we started to I I would say even not much past the Gemara. Uh-huh. But I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, so Gemara says Vaika Shalom Malchus, but it's Shalom Malchus. Right? We said that the reason why you have to date um a get according to the non Jewish not calendar, but according to the non Jewish leaders is for Shalom Malchus. Right? So 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 what about that case? There also we said that it's not a good get the Rabbana. So Gemara says, Hasam Tate There we said that she has to get divorced. Hachaloi Tate Fine, same Kasha. Honey, Chalamanda Amar Hachaloi Tate It's going according to Chalamanda Amar. It says, Loi Tate Se. Chalamanda Amar Tate Se. Michael Amar, what are you going to say? Our answer is, Hasam Havlad Mamzer, Hachavlad Kasha. There the Vlad is a Mamzer. And here the Vlad is a. Uh, it's a. Uh, uh, the kosher. So the Gemara says, "Honey, Chulur Meir." That's according to, to Reb Meir. Hello, Rabbanu, my Chulur Meir. According to Rabbanu, what are you going to say? The Mukim Lock is Reb Meir. We're going to say that our mission is going like like Reb Meir, right? The Hasam of Vlad Mamzer, and there the Vlad is a Mamzer. Also of Vlad Kosher. Here the Vlad is Kosher, right? So basically, you have to say, um, meaning the, the Mandomer that says. That she has to, that they have to get divorced, is going to be saying that our mission is going like Remeir, right? And 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 there by Shalom Malchus, there the Vlad is a Mamza, but Hacha here the Vlad is Kosher, right? Um, here they're going to say that the Vlad is Kosher. Why? Right? Because it's not. I I guess. I'm, I'm assuming that the pshat is because it's there here. It's the the, the get ba'etzim is okay with the right. So there, the chacham made a takana that there has to be dated a certain way, and you didn't make the date that you didn't date it properly. I think I don't know. I don't know if I'm right. But fine. Okay. So then the Gemara says minyana duration lamute mai minyana disable lamute mai. Anytime the Mishnah has a minion 
like accounting. So even though here it doesn't, it says how it, it says in the Mishnah array again, the Mishnah repeats itself. It says Shloisha Gitin Psulin. And then after it lists the three, it says Hare Shloisha Gitin Psulin. Right? So it says it twice. The minion of the Raisha Lamutema, Minion of the Sefer Lamutema. What's the minion of the Raisha for? What's the minion of the Sefer for? You know the Rachel Mute Hani Da Moran that's coming to exclude all the cases that we just said that are not part of the Mishnah. When you're on the safe for the Mute Hadatanya, the meaning of the safe is coming to exclude to, to exclude this we learned in the Bryce. And maybe again Medina Sayam. Right, somebody brought again Medina Sayam Nasnu La the Lai Amar Allah Bifnan and Echlavan and Echlam. Let's say he gave her the get, right? He just goes way back to the beginning of the Mesafta. And he has to say Bifan and Echlavan and Echlam. Let's say he didn't. Yaiti. Then she has to get divorced, Pablo and Mamza, and the kid is going to be a Mamza. That's how strong the Fanny and the Fanny Nechta was. Dear the mayor. Chamim Ramim. Ain't of Lad Mamza. The Chamim, like, same standard of mayor and Chamim Machlai. Because Lad's not a Mamza. Okay, so Kate said, yeah. So what are you supposed to do? Again, the guy comes to Medina Sayam. He's supposed to bring the get. And so he brings the get, and he's supposed to say the Fanny and the Fanny Nechta. He didn't. The Kondi Ramayor, the kid's a Mamza, and they have to get divorced if she got remarried based on this get. Tell him, say, the Vlad's not a mamza. Okay, so what should you do? Yitzleno heimena, take the get back from her. V'yachtav yitzleno love of nation. Go back and give it to her in front of two. V'yachtav yitzleno love of nation. And then say it's a funny nest, a funny nest. So then it's so then it's all right. Right? Um, fine. Then the Gemara says, the what was the case? It's kosa v'ksav yodav v'ena love edem. So the first thing we said was that it was written, the get was written in his handwriting. But there's no Aiden. Tomar Rav, Ksav Yoda Shinino. Rav says what we're saying is that it was the Ksav of his hand. That's what the mission is talking about. So hey, which case? What is what Rav saying? Ksav Yoda Shinino. Which case is it going on? Again, there's three cases in the Mishnah. Elema Resha. If it's going on the Resha, right? Which Pshita Ksav Yoda Katani. Rav is saying, oh, the Mishnah, the part of the Mishnah that says that somewhere where the get was in his handwriting is talking about where the get was in his handwriting. And obviously there's no Chiddush there. So it can't be going on the Rashi. Well, Amitsiyasa must be going in the middle case where he wrote the get without his man. Are Yeshua of Adim. It has Adim, so who cares? If a get has Adim, who cares whether the get is in the guy's um, handwriting or not? Ela Seifa must be going in the Seifa. Yeshua is man. Where it had his man in it, vein by Ella Edech, and it only had one aid in it. Right? The Gemara on Amav Eid, but that not Amav Eid. Now, but that's the Ksav Yadai veAid, veAid. Only if it has a Ksav Yadai. I mean, what Rav is saying, the Chiddush of Rav is that it's if it's, it's talking about where there's a Ksav Yadai, and it had a, had an aid with it. Av a Ksav Seifer veAid, but let's say it was the handwriting of the Seifer and one aid, then lo, it doesn't work. Right, because we're afraid that the cipher was not commissioned to be an aid. The Shmuel, that's the Rav, that's what Rav says. The Shmuel, Amar, I feel Ksav cipher of aid. Shmuel says even if it's the the Ksav of the cipher and an aid, Shereshaninu, because we learned Ksav cipher of aid, Kasher. We learned in a Mishnah later, two blocks from now, that the handwriting of a cipher and an aid is Kasher. Gemara, so the Gemara says for Rav, be dummy. Who, who says that you can compare the Mishnah later that says that the cipher writes to get and it is eight? It's kosher. Hasam, he nasi lechatchila. There, as she gets married, she's allowed to get married lechatchila. Hacha the Evid. Here, we're only allowing her to be married to the Evid. So you can't say that it's talking about a ksav and an eight. Right? Meaning, it's an interesting thing. He says you can't compare the two cases even though they seem to be saying the exact same thing. The ksav of a cipher. And an aid. He's saying they're not the same thing. Because in our case, in our Mishnah, we're saying that the Vlad's not a Mamzer. And here, um, and, and we, no, we're not getting involved in Mamzer. Meaning here, we're saying that she has to get to him. She, she can, here we're saying she cannot get married Lechatchila. But there we're saying that she could get married Lechatchila. The Shmuel, like Kasha, oh, what about, so how is it? It's a steer according to Shmuel. How is it the Muvuk? How is it the Loi Muvuk? It's interesting. I'm not exactly out of short, sure how to touch this muvuk. Here we're talking about a cipher who's muvuk, and one is a cipher that's not muvuk. So muvuk normally means 
Uh, Gersh, what do you call a cipher? Don't you call a cipher? Isn't there another thing we call a cipher? Not Mubak. Call him cipher Mubak? I mean, we don't really use this term today anyway. Cipher Mubak. Most, <laughs> most <laughs> harshness that are written today are definitely written by a Safra Deloy Mubak. No, no, I know, but isn't there a Lushan? Like you have a Moyal Mumcha, right? There's such thing as a Moyal Mumcha. Yeah, you have a right. Cypher Mumcha also. Called Cypher Mubak? Mumcha. Cypher Mumcha? Yeah. Half of the no, others are no. Arabs. It's not really Nagaya. I mean, there's all kinds of people writing Parshish today. No, I understand that. And this is a Raya, one second. This is a Raya against you, Gersh. And I don't want to go down this road, but <laughs> meaning. What do you mean? Who's using a cipher that's not Muvik for a get? Oh, most of us do. Oh, for a get, I don't know. The most harshest today is by cipher that are not Muvik. I understand. People use them every day. The Gemara is saying that there's enough of a chashash here that somebody would use a cipher Muvik for a get, and somebody may not use a cipher Muvik for a get. Right? Why is the Gemara just saying, yeah, there's no need to. Using... It's not about it's not ish. Yeah, but as long as he writes it correctly, it's okay. There's more of a chashash that it's incorrect with a cipher that's not moving. I hear. But it doesn't mean that it's by default incorrect. So we always busy every day kashering as harshest than written by cipher than not moving. He tries not to pass on stuff. Yeah. I don't know. I whatever. I'm just saying. Okay, what I, I don't got, <laughs> yeah. I'm just <laughs> all right. Let's go back. <laughs> Anyways, we're saying that a cipher move, so we can be confident that the get is written halakhically proper, right? And one is talking about a cipher that was not move, right? And then Mimela, if it's a cipher that's not move, you cannot use an edechor with that cipher. Okay, so again, I'm just not sure why you're using that type of stuff. Okay, Vechen Amar Vyachanon. Vyachanon said the same thing. Sav Yadah Shunino. Amar Le Rebbe Lazar, Hare Yeshel of Edim. Rebbe Lazar said to, to him, right? We it said was by David and Melech's army. So they were, I had to write 25,000 of them in two weeks. Mm. Yeah, so, and, they, and they didn't want to do silk screens. <laughs> right, right. Okay, there you go, Gesh. That was for you. Okay, so anyways. So I'm, uh, I'm really, really, still, silk screen is basically photocopy, not a fancy version of photocopy with, with ink. Anyways, I'm really, really, I'm 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 he should get divorced and Zinun Amar Rav Loi Teitzin. Sometimes he said not to go out. Okay, Sad Yesh Labanim. If she had kids, Loi Teitzin, don't go out. She, they shouldn't get divorced because if she gets divorced, if we force her to get divorced and she has kids, everybody's going to say those kids are mamzerim. Ain't Labanim. If she has no kids, then Teitzin. Right? This is your classic. You know, some guys say, "I'm telling you, I was by Rav's Bezdin and he made the lady get divorced." And the other guy comes and says, I'm telling you, I was by Rav's Bezdin, and he said that they could stay married. And each one is trying that they know exactly what's sock. And then, when they ask her the steer, very simple. One was where they already had kids, and one was they didn't have kids. Right? There you go. <laughs> the practical, practical, practical uh, fine. So, practical, so, in all these cases, right, well, no, no, I'm sorry, before all these cases. We have this, this is going back to Yavamas. So we know that from in Yavamas, you had those 15 Arayas, that if he had two wives, right, if a guy had two wives, one, let's say, was his niece, and one was another lady. And then he dies without kids, so then his father has to marry the daughter. The father, meaning this guy's brother, has to marry his own daughter, right, because there's a Mitzvah Yivam, which obviously you can't do. So Mamela, once she's Potter, so her co-wife also goes Potter. But what happens if the marriage, the original marriage, was a suffix of Kedushin, or maybe there was a suffix Gerishin, whether if the guy got divorced. So, if a cool and show you've been suffix Kedushin, a suffix Gerishin, 
It's like we know, anytime you have a suffix, that you're going to do lechumra, so you're going to make them do chalitza. She can't go scot free, right? We make her get chalitza, and obviously she can't do you. It's okay, it's not suffix kiddushin. What's the case of suffix kiddushin? Zorak lo kiddushin. He throws her the ring, let's say. Suffix karav law, suffix karav law. And we don't know whether it's closer to her, in which case she's married, or it's closer to him, in which case she's not married. They'll suffix kiddushin, that's suffix kiddushin. Suffix gerishin, what's the suffix of gerishin? Kasa basav yada vena lo Like our Mishnah. If it's written in his handwriting and there's no Aiden, Yesha love Aiden, the ain't by Zman. Or there is Aiden, but there's no Zman written in the, in the get. Yesh by Zman. Or there is a Zman, Vain by Yala Aid Echad, and there's only one Aid. I raise that Suffolk Gerishin. That's all Suffolk Gerishin. So now here it gets a little bit technical. If you say that she doesn't have to get divorced, so then Sarasa Akili of Ume, her Sarah, is going to end up doing yibum, meaning if we're saying that in these three cases of our Mishnah and she gets remarried based on it and that she does not have to get divorced, then what does it look like? It looks like that the, uh, the get was a good get. Right? So what's the, what's the, what's the meaning if it's a good get? If it's a good get, then there was never any issue. Meaning, again, let's use the example of the father. The brother married his niece, right? And then they had one of our, then he, get, he got divorced from his niece. One of our three spakers, either was handwriting, no aids, aids, whatever, any of the three spakers, right? So he got divorced. And then she went, his niece went and got remarried to somebody else. Okay, so now what happens? So now this this guy is married to a regular woman who's not related to her brother, to his brother. Now he dies, and his brother's going to do yibum, right? Because there's no sorrow. He got divorced. The brother that died got divorced from his niece, or at least a suffix divorce. So if we let them stay married, so then this other lady, meaning the co-wife, is going to say, "One second, she's she's say, she's married to this guy. That means that I'm not a sorrow, and I have to get yibum." Right, so why aren't we worried about yibum? So the Gemara answers to see how you can get married and there's nothing wrong. Why? Because chashash is the rabbanon. He, this, this whole thing is the chashash the rabbanon. Right? Meaning, what are we worried about? Because she may end up doing yibum. Let's say she does. Right? Meikar adin, she should have yibum done, because meikar adin, the divorce from the from the niece was a legitimate divorce, right? The Rabbanon came and said it's not a divorce, right? But really, she does do Yibam. So we were saying that she does Chalitza just to be safe. But if she does Yibam, okay, that's the Ekadin from the title. So it was, it was either on the Rabbanon. We're not going to make Gezeira and make this lady get divorced because her co-wife may end up doing Yibam. That's too, that's too far, which can be a whole schmooze unto itself. Like, at what point are Chacham concerned that things are going too far? So what's the answer to this? How does it work? He said, Now we're no, saying, no, she should, should do Yibam. supposed to do Chalitza and not do Yibam. But if for whatever reason she messes up and she does Yibam, Nishka Ferla. That, that's what it said. That's what it said. Hey, listen, when the Chachamim would say something like that and when they say, no, 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 we have to make a Gezeir, I don't want to do that because... Right. Um, Were there? Oh, Lakewood. Huh? Well, there's no shortage of rabbis on Lakewood. They could ask. I know. Okay, good. Okay. <laughs> We're either big rabbis, okay? No, either big rabbis. <laughs> okay, anyways, bye. You have to ask. Have you read the promise? You're losing time now. That's not going to be fair. The rabbis. Lady, sorry. Um. Uh. Anyway, so that's what the Gemara here is saying. That oh, what's the worst that's going to happen? It's going to be a. Is it going to be an Isser of a Derabanan? Okay, we don't have to make this. We don't have to make that clear. Okay. Well, now we got to. What are you saying? No, I was just still thinking about well, about this Matbeya. So I thought, like Cheren the Rebbeinu Gershon, that was that was he was a Rishon, right? Rebbeinu Gershon was a Rishon, a little before the Rishon, whatever. Yeah. Well, uh, he was a guy, no? Was a guy? Okay. Before, I mean, uh-huh. he was a guy of other. Everybody's <laughs> a guy now. Other casters. Right. He was. Okay, right. He, he, 
he could they, he, he could be misad the kedushin in this matter. Yes, yes, yes. For sure, for sure. <laughs> okay, uh, but, yeah. But that ha, that him and the hetamei rabbanon, like those those who think that <laughs> those things changed the uh, right. I mean, correct, correct. Okay, fine. So Levi Omar. Okay, so now okay, now we get a stickle of freebie here. Levi Omar. Levi says they never have to get divorced. Which the min huna is interesting. He's not the min huna, right? Which the the Masoras of Shas changes it to Haifa, right? Because um, the min huna. I mean, maybe I don't know if that has to do with huna or not. This is what your father said. She does not have to get divorced. And he said something else. The kartis sheba amir is a total tangent now. Kartis that you find in the amir. Amir is the stalk, right? Ena peselas mechatas is not does not passel mechatas. What does this mean? Because we know we had this. I forgot. We had end of soita maybe. We had that the mechatas, right? So what do you do? Somebody is coming, somebody may. So you got to take the ashes from the paraduma, mix it with the mechatas. And none of them could ever be used. So you mix it with the mechatas and uh, and uh, and then you sprinkle it on, right? So if anything happens, any malacha happens with the para or with the water, all possible, right? So what happens if an, an animal drinks from the water? An animal or a, bu- or a bug, in this case it's a bug, so it really depends. If it just touches it, so then it's okay. But if it goes into its mouth and it spits it back out, parents, what's it called when you do that? Uh, People that share soda, they don't like to do this thing with you know, you drink a bottle and it's it's, it's push not push yeah. back. Back, uh, back ones, I think. Back backwash. Backwash. Backwash, right? So there's backwash. So if there's backwash into the mechata, right, then it's gonna be no good. So the question is different bugs that would eat drink from it or different birds, what would be the day? So Mike, so he says that kartis that's in the Amir will not make the mechatos the puzzle. My kartis, Amr Abaya, did the debeni kepi. It's it's some sort of fly that you find in between the Amir, in between these uh, these uh, what do we call it? Uh, stalks, whatever it is. The mother of Daniel Barav Katina, kalaif is twice from mechatos. All birds pass on mechatos if they drink of it. Chutz min hayayna, except for a dove. Mibnei is because it just does Mitzitza. Mu Aaron was the type of Mitzitza. <laughs> yeah, your father got it clicked in before, but there, yeah, yeah, so he knows when the when the word is he feels it. Yes, anyways, Mitzitza. Mitzitza means to suck. All it does is suck the, the drink. It doesn't do any backwash. Then Isa, Nisni Chutzmi Yoyne Vikartis. If your father was right that a Kartis is also won't make it tummy, so then what's the, so then why do you say except for a Yoyne, not tummy, won't make a puzzle? He says, Leipzig alay. Meaning there was no stock on this. The Gedoyla, Leipzig Because the Gedoyla will not make it possible, meaning this, this type of bug will not make it possible. Katana Pasla, and but a small one will do it because it does have backwash. So meaning there's no, you can't say that all cartis makes Mechatos Pasla because it's not necessarily true. Vad Kama, Amravi, Ad Kazayat. How big does it have to be until it's considered large? Has to be the size of a kazai. Okay, that's just brought parenthetically. Fine. Revelaza, Revelaza, Raimer, Revelaza says Afal P, meaning even though there's no Adim, he doesn't care because his main thing is the Adim have to see the get being handed over. So Amar Yudam Arav, Allah Kareb Revelaza, but Gitin. Allah is like Revelaza, but Gitin. Meaning it sounds like only by Gitin is Allah like by Revelaza, but any other, any other star. Adem Mesira is not enough, and you have to actually have the Adem sign on the star. Can read the command of Shmuel, Amar Afi He says, even with Shtaris. The Rav Shtaris Loi. Rav says, sorry, it's a Kasha. The Rav Shtaris Loi. Rav says that Rebbe Lazo, we don't pass on like Rebbe Lazo by Shtaris, only by Geth. So Katani, we go even in the Chazim Mishabadim. In the Mishnah, it says that you can use a star. That was you know, all. All the all the Adam did was see the star handed over. You if it goes in chasim mishubadim, you can even get from nechasim that are uh, mishubat to people. So Gemara answer. Rebbe Lazar Tarti Amar. Rebbe Lazar said two different things. 
Meaning, he said that you don't need to get, you don't need Adam on the actual get, and you don't need Adam on the actual star. But Rav Sava Kavasei Bechada and Rav Paskins are by one for for Gittin. Paulo Galei Bechada and he disagrees with him by one. Chay Namar Rav Yaakov Aridi Amar Rav Yishuv Ben Levi Alach Kerev Belaza Begittin Rav Yana Yamar Afilu Reach Haget Ein Boy. So Rav Yana seems to disagree. He's saying not only is it not a kosher get, it doesn't even have a reach of a get, it doesn't even have a smell of a get. What does the smell of a get have to do with? It has to do with a koyin, right? If, if, even if the get is puzzle, but if, I mean, we had the machlaik, it's Beishamay held that even if a guy writes a get to his wife and he doesn't give it to her, she still cannot. She's considered divorced, right? Al koyin. So here he's saying, when there's some, if something has a reach of a get, it will puzzle a woman for, to a koyin, right? But uh, so Rav Yana is saying it doesn't even have a reach of a get, and therefore she would still be mutter if her husband was a kain. The Gemara asks Rav Yana, less like the Rav Elazar. Rav Yana does not hold Rav Elazar. The Gemara answers how she comes. The Rabbanon, I feel a reach of get ain't by Rav Yana. Paskins like Rav Elazar. I'm not sure why the Gemara is asking that he shouldn't paskin like Rav, that he sh- that he has to paskin like Rav Elazar. I'm not sure what the what the history of that is. But he's saying I didn't mean it for myself. He's saying according to the Rabbanon. Who disagree with Rabbi Lazar, it's not even a, a reach of a get. If it does not, if the get does not have signatures on it, there's no reach of a get. And he says, even no get. Blame Rabbi Yachin, less like Rabbi Lazar. That's Rabbi Yachin doesn't know Rabbi Lazar. According to Rabbi Lazar, even a, a reach of a get it doesn't have. Fine. Boy, me name it Rav Huna. They asked the Shem Ramuna, "Alocha Rav Elazar beget or no? Ain alocha? Is alocha like Rav Elazar beget or not?" Adahachi. Meanwhile, Noch Nashay the Rav Huna. Rav Huna passed away. Amar Le Rabba Bray. So Rabba, his son Rabba, said to who asked him? Mori, Mori Bar Mar. Right? Hachi Amar Abba Mishmei the Rava. Alocha Rav Elazar beget and alocha like Rav Elazar beget. Rabbi Seinu, Rabbi Kiyin, but the Dvar Halacha, Mishum Rabbeinu, Amar, but the Rabbeinu. That has to be Mishmei Derav, by the way. The Maser Sashas changes it. Oh, the Maser Sashas changes it, Rav, yes, yes, thank you. He was four yeah. generations earlier. He couldn't possibly have met Rav. But see, yeah, that, I, that's what I don't understand. Like, why, why would they assume, that they, I guess they didn't know the Halacha that Rav himself said. Or Rabbi Huda said the name of Rav. I guess they weren't in the same place as Rabbi Huda. I, I think there was a split. Because Rabbi Yudha already said in the name of Rav, Allah for Rabbi Lazar, Rav Huna is also a Talmud of Rav. Like, where, how did they not know? But then we have this a lot, right? They're not sure. Uh, even yesterday's stuff, where he changed, he said puzzle. And he said, oh, we have a kasha. Okay, I meant kasha. But so I guess these things, when they were given over verbally, were very difficult. Right? Okay, but Rabbi Zainu are Bikin, but Dvar Allah, and Bishim Rabbeinu, and our Rabbeim, who are Bikin and Dvar Allah, that's also an interesting one. And but that means that there are rabbeim that are not pekiim in dvar aloch, right? So like those guys say about big gedolim, they say, oh, they hear a psak from a big gedolim. Oh, he was a posek, right? They say like, oh, right. <laughs> this gemara is much more like them, right? <laughs> because Rabbi said a pekiim, but dvar aloch. Okay, whatever. Mr. Rabbeinu Amro, Halacha Karev Karev Elazar. Halacha Karev Elazar. Begitten. I'm sorry. Halacha Karev Elazar Begitten. Do Amro Rabchama Bargu Yama Rav. Halacha Karev Elazar Begitten. Ikeda Amri the Lord is a Vechavei Reino Abikim B'Dvar Halacha and our Chavei our our friends who are Abikim not a Rabbeim. My Rashi says it means Rav Chista. The Talmide Rabbeinu Mishum Rabbeinu Amro and Talmidim of Rabbeinu meaning Rav. Say halacha kareb alazer begitten halacha like kareb alazer begitten. Amar Rav Chista, Amar Rav Chama, Bar Guya, Amar Rav halacha kareb alazer begitten. V'chein ki also Rav, Amar Rav alazer, Amar Rav halacha kareb alazer begitten. I'm not like you, Akiva and Gershon, that I'm following the names here. I'm just so happy with after a daf like this and the daf coming up that it's just the, the somebody in Shas, Ravina Ravashi gave us gave us a freebie on this, right? The Bor Hashem. I'm not. I'm not even following the names. Yeah. Okay. I thought you were going to say something about the last line. It throws in Rav Elazar, saying Halacha Karebi Elazar. I hear. Right. No, we've had that a lot. It seems like Rav Elazar. Yeah, yeah. We have that a lot. Yeah. Okay. Next Mishnah. Again, yeah, yeah. 
this mission I think should be re should be there should be Akdama. Like this is the Mishnah of a bunch of cheap guys trying to all chip in to write one get. Right? That that's basically what this mission is all about. Uh so Shnaim Shoshokushno, not the first part. Shnaim Shoshokushne gets in Shovin. Two guys have the exact same get, meaning same name, same town, same everything. And the the two gitten got mixed up with each other. The nice and name was do which name what are you gonna do? We don't know who's who's was, was given to who. Who's was written for? The nice and name was do which name was do. You give both get into each one. Speak of, I mean, I get, give two get into one lady, take them back and give them back to the other lady, and then and then you're fine. The monastery. How does the before and left that work? What? How does before oh, so and left that work? Well, I don't know how. How would you do before and left? I don't know. I guess maybe they had the same. Oh, agent. they were both written at the same time. Same right. agent were available. In medicine. They got the same agent. But, uh, right, but it's a subject of which one I'm saying the agent son. Oh, so they're good. So the Gemara is going to ask a similar question to what you're asking, Akiva. The fika over echad mehen harei sheni bottle. If one of the gittin becomes lost, so now we have no idea who gets which get. So harei harei sheni bottle. So the second one is 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 mixed, and therefore you got to start again. Fine. Now, what about if you actually gave five, it? Is she a suffix Gershon? Who? If you if you by accident gave it, I don't know. It's suffix Gershon. Lachayra is suffix Gershon. No, maybe not. Maybe it's not even considered a suffix Gershon. Is it? I don't know. Uh, here, right here. It's a good question. Hamisha, then you have five guys. Shekotsu, cloud the seicha get. Five guys write a cloud inside the get, meaning they they just lump themselves together. And they wrote in the get Ish Pliny, Megarish Plinus, Upliny Plinus, right? Me, and then he writes his name and his wife's name. And then the then the next guy. And then five of them put this all together. And then there's Adam on the bottom. Ul and Ksharin, they're all considered kosher. And you have to give the get to each and every one of the women. Right? So the get's a kosher to get. So basically they have a buy five, buy one, get five free, get four free on the get. Right? You say, what do you I'm make? You make, doing make four stuff. photocopies? No, you give it to one, she gives it back, you give it to the next. Oh, is that what's happening? You... That, I, yeah, yeah, I think so. Are you cursed of typhus? But so that's if they made it in a cloud. Are you cursed of typhus? But if they wrote it in a typhus, so the typhus is, is, is just like the template of a guest. The basic stuff like we learned yesterday that she's going to be for herself and free, whatever, depending on what you hold, you have to write it again. So if they did a typhus for each one, meaning they didn't just thumb write one template and added five names. They, this one, they, they had one template for each set. Beidim al and then the Edim on the bottom. Esra Edim, Nikrin Imai Kosher. The Edim, wherever the Edim are closest to whichever typhus it is, meaning, again, there's five mini gittin inside this get. So in that case, the Mishnah is saying only the last, the last, Set next to the Aiden gets uh, what do you call it? Gets divorced. The rest are not. So again, so he's saying this really depends on how the mission is saying it depends on how you write to get. If they're just all included in the same lotion and they just added names, so then then they're all divorced. But if they didn't just add names, but each one like sort of like five getting on one page and then the signatures on the bottom, then. The only the last people are divorced and Now tomorrow we're gonna to have a machlaikis Rabbi Yochan and Rish Lakish how to understand this Mishnah. Hence hence it's not a simple da. Yeah. Okay, so tomorrow let's just do the next three lines. Mantana, who's the Tana? Right? That uh, we said that if the going in the first case, that the get and get mixed up, you give it to you give both to each wife. I'm Rabbi Yemi like Rebelaza. This is not like Rebelaza, the Rebelaza. Like what Akiva was saying, even Dhamma Aidim is Sirakarti since Revelazar holds. That the main Aidim are the ones that hand over the get. They don't know which get is going to each one, meaning you need it to be Lishma. How do they know if the main Aidim here are not the ones that are signed? And if the Aidim, the main Aidim are the ones that are signed, so then each one is in a get, so you give both of them, fine. But here, if the main get, the main Aidim is that seeing the get handed over, so then they, there's no way to know Lishma. They can't, it's not Lishma because they don't know if that's a legitimate get that's supposed to be going to this to this woman. 
the Gemara answers, Abai Omar, Afibu Tame Rebbe Lazar. We could say it's going to Rebbe Lazar. Aim at the Bay Rebbe Lazar, Ksiva Lashma. Rebbe Lazar holds that a get needs to be written Lashma. Nasina Lashma, me boy. Who says he holds that Nasina has to be Lashma? Meaning, as long as it's given, it's uh, you need Adam that it's given, fine. But the giving does not have to be Lashma. The writing of the get has to be Lashma. The giving does does not. Okay, we'll stop here and fasten your seatbelt for tomorrow's uh, for tomorrow's. <laughs> Tomorrow's dash is uh, a lot of about technical stuff. All right.